Hey guys, it's Dan from DanFromImagination.com and it's time for another video and this time level comparison. A lot of you have been asking what are the level differences that we are painting because we paint in six different paint levels. Actually level one we usually don't paint, almost no one wants level one, but it would be good to have a good comparison video. So what we did, we painted a Primaris Captain in focus armor in the vanilla color scheme of Ultramarines and uh, we did him in six levels six paint levels let's check out what are the differences in all the levels this is an example of a level one model as you can see not very much is done over here the armor is just airbrushed the cape as well has one color on it most of the details like uh, this little skull on his belt aren't picked up, the lenses aren't even done, so we don't we're not even doing level one at the moment, so as you can see it looks like this. A level two model gets a little bit more extra love. Most of the details are being picked up. Some of them have two colors put in, like this little screen over here, and uh, the lenses are done with one color and not anything cool in particular going on on level 2 just your basic paint job to have like minimal requirements done for gaming level 3 as you can see there's much more going on uh, it's a big leap between level 2 and level 3 uh, you can see some blink effects down on the screen here and uh, there is a little camel pattern starting to show also the lenses of the helmet are done there's some lining on the weapon as well as the armor the armor is done in multiple colors the joints are done black with gray highlights so yeah this is a level 3 if you want a big bulk of models like a Skaven army or something like that, level 3 is the best option in my opinion. Now we go to level 4. This is level 4 and this is your high tabletop standard. You have a lot of troops and I want them looking cool. This is the way to go. No detail is missed, everything is done. There are uh, on most of the parts there is a single highlight, some have two highlights and the lenses are done, the face ha is starting to have a really nice feature, the eyes are done, you can see the pupil so yeah, all this detail is being picked up on level 4 moving on to a much higher level, level 5, this is really closely resembling the uh, Games Workshop box art cover Some of the Games Workshop box arts are actually level 6, really high detail painting But a big bulk of them are level 5 And this is what you can expect from our level 5 That the box art cover quality is replicated on miniatures that you order at Den of Imagination At level 5, and this is how it looks And finally, level 6, it's the competition level, you can see the armor is done with black lining, uh, it reflects surfaces done by brush, uh, there are little freehand patterns on the helmet, and the shoulder pads as well has uh, some uh, weathering effect over here done, as you can see the head has a lot of fine detail done. The shading, you can see uh, touch, touches of red and violet. This is a really, really high detail paint job. And as well, it's a big leap between level 5 to level 6 in detail. Everything is being picked up and everything is done with care and multiple highlights. Almost no elements are done with a single highlight. Makes the miniature pop. It really is the way to go for your characters, for your leaders, for your 
for basically your crown jewel of the army level 6 is the way to go ok guys thanks for watching uh, be sure to leave a comment, subscribe and like the video share it with your friends and be good to your neighbors as always bye bye